Hey guys, it's Julia, and welcome back to my channel. And for today's video, we're gonna be going through my whole TBR pile. And before you guys are like, you have way too many books that you haven't read, I know. Thanks, leave me alone. Um, I know there's people who have less than this, also people who have more than this, so don't kill me. I do like having options to choose from, and I, I think I have around roughly a thousand books, and there's about 250-ish that I haven't read, which isn't bad. It's not a bad ratio, but it is a lot of books I haven't read. So let's go through them all, and if there's any that you see that I absolutely need to read ASAP, do let me know um, so I can put them up on my TBR. But yes, and nothing in this video will be from my February book haul. So nothing I bought in February will be in this video because you gotta wait to see what those books are. So, cheers, let's get into it. That's not the way it goes. I have to wait till I get to the other side just to see. The Tommy Knockers by Stephen King. Pet Cemetery, Stand, Gerald's Game, The Dead Zone. I have read King, I promise. It's just I own a lot of books by him. Um, Cujo, which I have to read like the last quarter, literally read up to this point. Come on, just gotta finish this. I'll probably have to restart it though. But yes, Cujo, Dreamcatcher, Insomnia, The Regulators, and Desperation. And these guys make up. Or is it the other way? Can't see. Can't see. I'm blind. Yeah, it's the other way. They make up a picture. Duma Key by Stephen King. Everything's eventual. Fuck! Nightmares and Dreamscape. Dollar is Airborne and From a Buick 8. I also have Christine, but it's in this huge stack and I don't feel like grabbing it, so I'm not going to. And I have the dark half as well. Full Dark No Star by Stephen King. Revival. Hearts in Atlantis. And Sleeping Beauties by King. You guys have been killing me to read this. It will happen eventually, I promise. Eventually. I have different seasons and Four Past Midnight. They're just in a stack. <laughs> Blaze. Then I have Hannibal and Hannibal Rising, both by Thomas Harris. The Fireman by Joe Hill. 1122, 63 by Stephen King. Thinner by Stephen King. Sick by Chelsea Kane. I have Riders by Veronica Rossi. I have the last book in the, Mid in the Young Elites trilogy, but I only have the last book, The Midnight Star, because it was on sale. But I'm hoping to get the rest. And I have The Serpent King by Jeff Zentner. Heard great things about this one. Next up here, I have The Roundhouse by Louis Ardrich. And I also have the or the Orchidist by Am Amanda Copeland. These got bomb spines. I have the entire Unwind series by Neil Schusterman. I blame Olivia. Next up here, I have American Gods, Anais Boys, Neverwhere, and Stardust by Neil Gaiman. I believe in a thing called love. Three Sides of a Heart. Love Life in the List by Casey West. Last Spare by Lauren Destefano. Wild Beauty by Anna Marie McLemore. American Street by Ivy Zoboy. Uh, Saints and Misfits by SK Alley. My Lady Jane. The Adventure Ends. Nowhere Girls. Meet Cute. Tonight the Streets Are Ours by Layla Sales. The Love That Split the World by Emily Henry. Written in the Stars by Aisha Saheed. From the Tree by Robin Benway. Exit Pursuit by Bear by E.K. Johnston. Phantom Limbs by Paula Garner. Her, I've heard nothing about this, but I've seen it. <laughs> the Girl Who Fell by S.M. Parker. Autobiography by Christina Lauren. The Museum of Heartbreak by Meg Ledger. Turtles All the Way Down by John Green. All the Crooked Saints by Maggie Steve Otter. Something in Between by Melissa De La Cruz. Daughter of Deep Silence by Carrie Ryan. Lily and Duncan by Donna Gephardt. Vanishing Girls by Lauren Oliver. Daddy and Charlotte by Brittany Cavallaro. On Among the Sticks and Bones by Shawna McGuire. And We Are Okay by Nina LaCour. Going down the shelf. Sweet Bitter by Ste Stephanie Danler. Five to One by Holly Bodger. Wolf in White Van by John Darnell. What We Saw by Aaron Hartzler. The Lovely Reckless by Cami Garcia. The Amateurs by Sarah Shepard. Gemini by Sonia Makirji. The Telling by Alexander Saroi. A Shadow Bright and Burning by Jessica Clewis. Beautiful Broken Girls by Kim Savage. All In and Bad Blood by... Jennifer, Je I was about to say Jennifer L. Armstrong. Jennifer Lynn Barnes. The entire Michelle, uh, the entire Mara Diet trilogy by Michelle Hodkin. Text by Michelle K. Cries. And The Leaving by Tara Altibrando. Jane Young by Gabrielle Zevin. The Lonely Hearts Hotel by Heather O'Neill. The Goldfinch by Donna Tart. The Woman in Cabin 10. Pretty Girls by Karen Slaughter. Gunslinger Girl by Lindsay Alley. Little Fires Everywhere by Celeste Inc. The Outliers by Kimberly McCrate. 
And then I have the first two books in the, what are these called? The DC Icons books? Yes. So first is Wonder Woman Warbringer by Leigh Bardugo. And next is Batman Nightwalker by Mary Lou. Scythe by Neil Shusterman. And Alive by Scott Sigler. So that completes my two new shots. <laughs> Guess who needs a nap? Me. Absolute True Diary of a Part-Time Indian by Sherman Alexi. We're putting them there. I don't give a fuck. Internet Famous by Dana Danica Stone. How to Hang a Witch by Andre Mether. On the Fence and By Your Side, both by Casey West. How do people romance finally through these videos? I'm fucking tired. Forbidden by Tabitha Susu by Tabitha Suzuma. I've had this book for so long. Sold by Patricia by Patricia McCormack. We All Looked Up by Tommy Wallace. Shooting Animals by Jonathan Safran Forer. Faithful by Alice Hoffman. Homegoing by Yaa Jesse. Still for the time being by Ruth Ozeki. Saj is literally probably dying. Under by Emma Donahue. Sex by Jeffrey Eugenides. And All the Beautiful and Wonderful Things by Brian Greenwood. So these are really quick reads for me, but we'll go through them anyways. So I have The Lover's Dictionary by David Levithan. M by Rudy Francisco. Then I also have this, It Shouldn't Have Been Beautiful by Leah Purpuria. Then I have Wild Embers by Nikita Gill. And I also have Poems from the Typewriter series by Kyle Knott Gregson. Building Up the Universe by Jennifer Niven. The Names They Gave Us by Emery Lord. Beauty Queens by Loba Bray. Glory O'Brien's History of the Future by A.S. King. Full Met Rishi by Sonia Manon. Our Chemical Hearts by Chris Crystal Sutherland. Bad Romance by Heather Demetrios. Look at that spine. Yeah. Radio Science by Alice Oseman. The Ever After by Kira Cass. The Bees by Leyland Paul. Before I Go to Sleep by S.J. Watson. The Good Daughter by Karen Slaughter. Her Villains by M.L. Ryu. Her Eyes by Sarah Pinborough. And in the Divine Comedy, I have Purgatory and Paradiso to read. I have read Inferno. The Subtle Art of Not Giving a Fuck by Mark Manson. The True Story of the Manson Murders by Vincent Bogaliso with Kurt Gentry. That's wrong, but whatever. And Birdie by Tracy Lindbergh. Love Now by Meg Rosoff. The Opposite of Loneliness by Maria Keegan. Girl Boss by Sophie Amaruso. And Romeo and What's Her Name by Shanae Petroff. Scar Tissue by An Anthony Kedis. My shells are so bad right now. Uh, Side Effects May Vary by Julie Murphy. A Madness So Discreet by Mindy McGuinness. The Hating Game by Sally Thorne. The Cemetery Boys by Heather he by Heather Brewer. Tiger Lily by Jody Lynn Anderson. My Quest for Peace and the Two Marias by Jonathan Keslev. The Duke and I by Julia Quinn. My Luck Is My Name by Howard Jacobson. Carry Me Like Water by Benjamin O'Leary Science. The Handmaid's Tale by Margaret Atwood. A Secret History by Donna Tartt. And Challenger Deep by Neil Schusterman. Beautiful Broken Things and A Quiet Kind of Thunder, both by Sarah Bernard. Everyone's an Alien When You're an Alien Too. And then by Emma Mills. Trouble by Non Pratt. Um, uh, Where Things Come Back by John Corey Whaley. Summer I Turned Pretty, Silver Linings Playbook, Winter Girl by Lori Hulse Anderson, He Forgot to Say Goodbye by Benjamin O'Leary Science. So this is my current view. Am I mad? Yes. Oh look at that, my camera's gonna die. <laughs> so it's super hard for me to get in here and for you guys to see. But The Dinner, I haven't read. Can barely see that. The Good Girl, The Revenant, Haunted. There's some back here that I haven't read yet. Geek Girl I haven't read. Small, The Language to a Small Angry Planet. Then we'll go over here because I'm tired. Um, the Bell Jar I haven't read. The Gigantic Beard That Was Evil I haven't read. I have to read the rest of the Vampire Academy series, four, five, and six. The Arenda by Joseph Boyden. I, some classics down here. Um, Every Last Lie by Marie Kubica, I See by Claire McIntosh, In Order to Live by Naomi Park, um, The Bone Season by Samantha Shannon, Dark Lover, uh, Five, Six, and Seven of Harry Potter, Burn, no, Smoke by Ellen Hopkins, The Girls, Jane Steele, Night Film, Because You Love to Hate Me, Heartless Carval, Might Unhaul This, uh, Trapped Under the Sea, Six of Crows and Crooked Kingdom. Um, the last book, the blue book, so Rise of the Owl of the Lost. 
Unhooked by Lisa Maxwell, Three Dark Crowns, um, the first two books by V.E. Schwab, so A Darker Shade of Magic, and The Gathering of Shadows, Girl of Nightmares, Replica, One of Us is Lying, Walk on Earth a Stranger, Furthermore, The Sacred Lies of Men, oh boy, Wolf by Wolf, The Strange and Beautiful Sorrows of Ada Lavender, The Siren, no, I did read The Siren, and I've read The Strange and Beautiful Sorrows, what's wrong with me? Uh, Rebel of the Sands and Joyride. Next we have these, so I haven't read more than this. How to Love, Goodbye Days, OC Love Story, Love and Gelato, The Vegetarian, Every Day and Another Day, Hello, no, I've read those ones. <laughs> I'm like dying. The Last Boy and Girl in the World, um, Taj Hart's Tolstoy. Then for these, I haven't read those little classics in the corner. Most of them I haven't read. I've read all of these except for three, four, five, and six of Tokyo Ghoul. And I've read all of these, except I do need to finish up Tales from the Shadowhunter Academy. Up here is really hard to reach, but I need to finish the last three books in the Raven Cycle. I need to read Wonder and Moxie. I'm quitting booktube. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'm probably gonna do an unhaul after this because this made me realize how many of these books that I don't really care about. So, look out for that maybe. I'm anticipating the end.